Hi YouTubers, this is Dream Bieza and I am back to do my product reviews. I'm going to be doing reviews on Giovanni as well as the Curls line and my Honey Child and also Mitch Chick. So, oh and be mine, I do I have purchased a few products from them, so I'll give my reviews for those as well. I wanted to start off with the mix chicks, get it out the way. I'm sure, like I said in my previous video, many of the transitioners out there, many of the curly girls out there, for women who are in search of defining curls or, you know, a better product to use for their curls, everyone has come across this line. Mix chicks. This is actually my mix chicks shampoo. It does contain sulfate, yeah, lower sulfate, as well as I have the Mixed Chicks Leave-In Conditioner, as well as the Mixed Chicks Deep Conditioner. Okay, so what I like about this line, I like that the shampoo does contain sulfate because I do believe that you should have at least one sulfate shampoo in your collection for when you have to thoroughly cleanse your hair. I believe that you should clarify your hair at least once a month, if not twice, depending on how your hair is and how much moisture is required. Uh, I love it. This is the only sulfate shampoo that I own. And originally when I purchased the product, I was very much curly girl method and no sulfates. But there are times when you may really need to cleanse your hair because of the different products that you may be using, i.e. gels or uh, mousses or, you know, sometimes when you have to saturate your hair with oils and you don't want your hair to be very oily. So I use this. I like it. I will be, depending, I have to go back and look at the pricing because I purchased this so long ago, but I may be repurchasing off the strength of the fact that I have so much of the leave-in conditioner left. So yeah, I like it. Uh, for women out there who do not wish to use a shampoo that contains sulfate, I would not recommend this because it does get your hair extremely clean. As far as the deep conditioner, let's go here first. As far as the deep conditioner, I can't say that I am a fan, but I can't say that I'm not, because really I don't have much experience with it. You can. It has a very, very, very perfumey smell to it. I've only probably used this product about twice, and uh, I can't really give much of a review on it. I will say this, I didn't notice anything deep about it. Maybe, possibly, I didn't use it the right way, but I didn't feel like it did much of anything. It reminded me of a conditioner. Not so much a deep conditioner, but just a conditioner. I have about 85% of that left. And as for the Mixed Chicks Leave-In Conditioner, I like it. I haven't used very much of it. I probably used about a third or a little less than a third of the bottle. I like it. Uh, it does exactly what it says it's supposed to do, but it contains silicones, which might be an issue for fellow curly girls, as well as the fact that if you use too much, it could leave your hair a little bit crunchy or hard, and that may not be, obviously, I don't know, too many people who walk around saying, hey, I want my hair to be crunchy. True. But it does help to define your curls. It does help to give your hair a little bit of hold. And I like it. When I use it, I get really great results from it. For those of you who um, have a five key, you can go and check out some of my pictures from me using it. And sometimes I actually use this product without using the sulfate shampoo that it comes with. I'll sometimes mix it with my curls conditioners. You know, I'll use that first to co-wash my hair and then I'll put this in as my styling product and it works so I like it 
my overall review for mixed chicks would be that for women out there who wish to go the curly girl method and eliminate silicones and those of you who wish to eliminate sulfates, mixed chicks would not be your line of choice. I love the results, but it's not something that I use every day or every other day. It's something that I use when I don't have a lot of time to deal with my hair and I really just don't care. But the products are very perfumey. They ship very fast and I like them. It's just I wouldn't recommend them every day. For people who have tried mixed chicks, if you want, you can leave your review. You know, let me know what you thought. How did it work in your hair? Uh, maybe show some pictures. And if you'd like, you could visit my Fat Key, which is gorgeous curly me um, at Fat And you can check out some of my pictures. All right.